Roost, come in. Things went to shit. We took refuge inside a castle, but I've just been separated from Baby Eagle. Say, you. Roost, you're breaking up. Do you read me? Damn it. So much for that. All right, welcome back to another exciting episode of Resident Evil 4 Remake. This is Chapter 8. Before we continue on much further, I'm just going to look around. So this is actually the area that we came from. We don't need to go back. And right off the bat, we're going to find a merchant right here. Uh, before we do anything, though, come over here in this little flooded area and you will find some fish and the fish are very nice because we will be able to eat them for healing which will be very useful in the future because we're probably going to take a bunch of damage in this episode yeah all right well i <laughs> the only things i want to craft are the things that i can't really craft which is mostly shotgun and rifle but yeah let's go ahead and go knife fishing <coughs> Should be a couple more bass in here. Somewhere. Alright. I think that's all of them. Uh, I don't think there's anything around the fountain. Uh, one secret that might save you a little bit of time though. As we're coming near the merchant. After we get this thing of course. There is like a, a nest right there. I must have already done it. Oh, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. There it is. What? Wait, what? There we go. If you shoot that and get this scratched emerald, it's actually a quest turn in for the merchant before we even get the quest. And I know you guys could probably hear that clockwork castle in. I think it's in there and that's going to be in a totally separate episode believe it or not we're not even going to get that in this chapter so let's go ahead and having a rough day stranger no not at all it's actually been a great day welcome got some rare things on sale stranger so let's sell the dungeon key the gold bangle the oh golden hourglass the elegant perfume bottle and the scratched emerald this is what I'm talking about. <laughs> I'm gonna sell them Fine, mines. Well. Don't need them. Well, well. And is there any I ammunition I don't like want? This. Nah, we're good. Well, look at you, mate. Came into some other bits and bobs too. Um, you can buy the Matilda pistol now, which is something not very good by itself. But buy. later on, you're gonna be able to upgrade it to do three-round burst, which is kind of cool but I'm not really into that so not really worried about it uh, one thing I will get though is the high powered scope we're gonna go ahead and get <laughs> that for sure the needle with a bullet there, mate. and then let's sell our old scope before we forget not bad. and can we tune up any of our weapons let's let's increase the power on See how that the rifle feels, and like yourself, reload speed rate the of fire right away. Might as well just Dazzled, keep going. Are you? <laughs> oh, cross oh dang it. I need the body armor. All right, we need to sell one more thing. Uh, the bolt thrower is in storage. I could just sell it. Honestly, I don't know if I'm going to use it again, but instead, I'm going to sell this fish for 1400 Thank you. That'll allow us to buy the body armor, which will... Auto equip, and as you can see, I'm already wearing it. Looks pretty cool. Let's go ahead and attach the scope to our rifle, and then I think we're good to go. I don't have a lot of ammo, it's one of my concerns. I can craft handgun, that's not a big deal. We'll be all right. Let's go ahead and save before we head out of here. All right, we're good to continue on. So, this chapter is pretty fun. Uh, I will say that, like, pretty much this entire chapter, I don't think is in the original. Like, the, the things that we're going to be doing 
So it's it's kind of exciting for me and for players who've played the original because this is all kind of new. I could be wrong, but I really don't remember this part in the original. This this whole chapter, basically. You'll see what I mean as we go. Oh, hi, guys. These guys are actually all dead already, so don't this even worry about up. it. Is it? It looks kind of like a art statue. I don't, I don't think it's even real. This door is locked. Pretty sure. Yep. Uh, it's locked. Let's continue on. You can hear a bunch of people chanting. Let's drop down. Consign the crimson flame. The voice of pestilence dwells in the flames, leading the pitiful souls to salvation. Consign the crimson flame to its rightful place, for you shall be enlightened and the path revealed. Basically, uh, you can see here the crimson flame is missing, so to open this door, we're going to need that. And in fact, you can see where it is, right there. But do not shoot this guy, because if you do, he's going to start chanting that's going to really mess with your head and like interrupt you every five seconds. Instead, I recommend sneaking in here. Okay. Obviously. Let's sneak to the right. Don't even worry about those those guys that just had their heads exploded. A little bit of stealth can go a long ways. Quickly swing around here if we can, please. Thank you. Now, there's a bunch of snipers up here. We should be able to take them out without being noticed. There's one. If you don't take the stealth approach, you can just go in guns blazing. But either way, we're going to have to do a bit of gun fighting after we take out these guys. Some gunpowder. We'll come back and flip that switch, which will drop the chandelier on top of all those dudes down there. But there's one more sniper over here. After we kill this guy, we're going to want to take out the red robed guy as fast as possible. Don't even worry about all these crates. We'll get them after the coast is clear. I have a lot of grenades, so I think that's the route I'm going to take here. If, if needed. Okay, he saw me. Wait, where'd the guy go? Where'd the red guy go? He literally disappeared. I didn't even know he could move like that. Oh, there he is. Can't escape. Did that get him? All right, one more frag. That should definitely work. You still alive? Okay, well, this is not going according to plan at all, but it's okay. We can improvise. Okay, now he's dead, right? No, 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 get off me. Let's run this way. There's actually another red barrel somewhere around here, I think. We got the Crimson Lantern. I didn't know he teleported, but now, now you know. A uh, better way to do that would be to stand up there and snipe him after you take out this third guy over here, but whatever. I tried to shoot the axe out of the air. I'm pretty bad at aiming right now, apparently. Grab all the loot. Oh, hi. Some handgun ammo. Oh, hi. That worked. We 
we got the rifle ammo, might as well use it, right? Oh, hi. Ew, don't shoot that at me. Are you... He takes a lot of damage. My goodness! That dude just took so many shots. Wasting our ammo. Our precious ammo. I need more gunpowder. Uh, let's get all the loot now that everyone is fully dead. I suppose you don't even really have to uh, kill all those guys, but whatever. Alright, I think we're good. Just do one final check on the loot. I think we're good. Okay. Let's go back and put the lantern on the spot. Now, can I craft, craft rifle ammo, but I'd rather craft handgun or shotgun. Shotgun is so expensive, but I literally don't have like any shotgun shells or handgun ammo. <laughs> I need both. <laughs> Dang. We, we're going to be low on ammo, so we're going to have to be very careful not to miss any shots. Ah, this is the door back to where we were. Kind of useless now. Let's go ahead and continue. Oh, no, oh, never mind. Good. Need Ashley to go that way. Lantern. Just making sure I didn't miss any loot. Looks like we're good. There we go. Precious handgun ammo. Ammo hasn't really been an issue yet up until this point. You can stop right there, Leon. Ada. Wouldn't make me use this, would you? Well, after six years, that is one hell of a greeting, Ada. You don't seem surprised. Interesting. I'm never surprised, Ada. Try using knives next time. Better for close encounters. Not a bad move. Very smooth. So who are you working for this time? Oh, Leon. You know I don't work in town. Leave the girl. She's lost no matter what. False. You walk away now. And who knows? Maybe you'll live to meet me again. And then I might get you that greeting you were looking for. You think I'm gonna give up that easy? Right. How about we continue this discussion another time? Sounds good to me. <laughs> Last person I thought I'd run to here. All right. Um, there's actually a bunch of loot in this area. I thought there was a lantern somewhere, but maybe not. Uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and grab all of these lithographs. There should be a few of them. Alright, and there should be... Oh yeah, this thing is really nice. Extravagant clock. We can put a couple gems in there. Ah, there it is. I knew I heard something. Uh, uh, we need a small key to open that, but... We'll come back for that another time, probably. Okay. So, with all of these 
lithographic stones. We're gonna try to solve this puzzle over here. Just just put them all into place. It doesn't really matter because we can move them around. So what we want to do is we want to put we want to match them. So you can see the shield is up here. Let's let's do this. The the thing is though you gotta swap them a little bit because. They don't exactly match perfectly. Okay, that's actually right, but I'm not using the right stones. So let's put that one there. And that one there. There we go. That should do it. What are you looking at? All right. Need to find Ashley. Now the fun really begins. Dang rats. Illuminados 3-2. Hear the signal echo through the mountains. Rocks become gravel and castle walls crumble. Behold the crimson shade of the night sky. A river tainted of blood befouls the sea. Sacrifice your life and the blood of your enemy. Atone for your ancient sins. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Throw that book right in the fire. Oh, great. That looks like uh, something we're going to have to blow up very quickly. You can use a small key back on the cupboard back there, but I think there's actually a better cupboard uh a little bit further on, so I'm going to actually save the key for the next one. It's up to you, though, which one you want to use it for. Either one's probably you know, pretty good. Great! Could have sworn I shot that, but whatever. Or, I mean, deflected. I was trying to knife parry. Parry is the word. And again, I have like no ammo. This is ridiculous. Can I please craft handgun? There we go. I thought I had a charm that gave me like bonus handgun ammo every time I crafted, but... Um... Yeah, let's just do this. Anyways, let's keep it going. <laughs> Why not treat yourself, mate? Eh, you're right. I should probably Welcome. sell. Where would it sell what that. Sell this. At the very least. <laughs> Thank you. Um, he can actually repair the body armor as well. Give that the care it deserves. Pretty cool. Easy work. All right, there fully upgraded weapons. You I wish he sold uh, gunpowder. I don't really need these resources. You know you what I mean? Bang for your buck. Come. I got plenty of uh, of those. Come back any time. All right. Time for some sniping, and I better not miss, because I don't have a lot of ammo. One, two, and three. Meeting you once was enough. How convenient, as I was growing tired of the modern touch. Uh, out of the way. 
Wait, were you were you talking to me? Did you say something? Sorry, I wasn't listening. <laughs> More handgun ammo, beautiful. Can I get shotgun ammo? Or is that asking a little bit too much? Can I reach this barrel? I can. Um, don't don't flip the switch yet. It sounds like there's another parasite nearby. Oh, hi. What are you doing there, buddy? You good? No, 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 don't. Don't kill that guy, he's mine. Find your own guy to kill. Or whatever you're doing to it. I think there's treasure above us, because, yeah, it's definitely not down here. Let's go through this door and drop down, I believe. We might have to flip the switch. Nah, I think we're good. That's why I didn't want to flip it the first time. Down we go. We can go back or forward. Both options. All right. They keep coming. I would worry about the uh, little parasite thing first, because these guys are pretty weak without the parasite attached to them. Sick. More gunpowder. Come over here, guys. Come over here. You guys good? One down. Get off of me. My goodness. Gonna have to force me to eat a fish. Rifle ammo, beautiful. Just making sure I didn't miss anything. I think there's a crate. There we go. We are going to have to flip a switch at some point, and I think now is the time. Yeah. Okay. Let's go from sun to moon. That'll open all the moon doors and close all the sun doors. And while it's flipped to moon, we want to keep it on the moon for a little bit. Oh, hi. And let's drop down here. And this should allow us to get a treasure. What are you doing? Some more gunpowder, but only two. Ah, here it is. I was wondering where the treasure was. This is actually a really good treasure. Look at that. It has four sockets. That's incredible. Let's do, oh dang, I, I can actually do all four different colors, which I think is worth the most. Boom, four color bonus. Wow, that alone is worth 51K. Like I said, worth, worth coming down for the treasure. And then we can come back where we were. Oh, I got more rifle ammo. Beautiful. Now, it's about to get pretty spicy. Um, 
Well, I'm not going to ruin it for you. You'll see in a second. Making sure there's no more loot. Ah, yes, da. Oh. Can the shield guy go through a door? Oh, you're throwing through the bars? That's pretty cool. What's the matter? You can't go through the door? Oh, okay, you can. Cool. Thank you for the ammo. I was needing that. And you need to calm down. <laughs> what are you doing? Hi. Could have sworn I was already done killing all the enemies, but somehow you survive. All right. Now, before we leave, let's shoot that. That'll open a gate over there. Doesn't help us at the moment, but it will in a little bit. All right, let's continue up. And this is where it gets exciting. Hi. Another one. You guys are really starting to become like a giant pain in my ass. Keyword on giant. So obviously with all this yellow paint, the game really wants us to go down there, but that's exactly why we're not gonna do that. Let's run the other way and jump down. Just try not to die. Wait for him to throw, then sprint. if possible without getting hit preferably Whew. run all the way around magnum ammo don't even waste uh, bullets shooting at him with your little guns <laughs> We need a much bigger gun to damage this guy. Let's get the loot. Emerald and a yellow herb. The yellow herb we can actually combine to make a super potion. Alright, let's drop back down and swing around. If you're trying to get all the clockwork castle in, there is one right there. I already got it. Not the one we heard at the beginning of the episode, though. If he hits you with the rocks, it's not that much damage because we have the body armor. But if you get hit, it will knock you down pretty hard. So just be careful about that. Alright, let's run. We need to shoot that to open the gate he lo he, he's like where did he go okay now we're gonna go the way that the game wanted us to there's no loot up here right right just want to make sure okay no loot bye bye That will allow us back in here, which not really needed, but whatever. Let's run across. Actually, better wait. Okay, run. I think there's a couple guys in here, so just get ready. I was hoping he would get hit by the troll, but not so much. 
Okay. We're doing just fine. I haven't even been touched. Now, before we go, I think we can snipe some guys over here. Can't see. Please stop throwing that stuff. Any more? I think we can run now. If you're impatient and you try to run too much, he will get you though, so just be careful. Let's just turn around, come in here. Hopefully he'll throw. Ah. Oh. Come on, I want you to get hit by the guy. I want that ammo. Okay. In here. Let's go ahead and flip the switch. Yeah, we have no choice. Back to the sun. Don't go up the ladder yet. Turn around and go back in here. <laughs> he dodged the giant only to get exploded by the barrel. run across the other side, get the other barrel, and then we'll go up the ladder. Ooh, gunpowder. Oh, but I need small resources. I guess I could make uh, rifle ammo. That's always useful. I really need pistol and shotgun, though. I'll just save. Go, Leon, go, Leon. Oh boy, I'm gonna get hit. Maybe not. Wrong way. Yes. Get it. This is the big gun I was talking about. This gun will do some damage. This is the cupboard I was talking about that we wanted to save the small key for because we can get an ornate beetle there. It looks really cool. Looks more like a scarab than a beetle. But. No, no, no. Pick up the money. Thank you. That is actually the way forward, but don't even waste your ammo sniping them because we're going to have a cannon blast them in a moment. I'm looking for the other weight that we got to break to. There it is. My turn. Get ready. Direct hit. Shut up, will you? You're way too loud. Adios. Hey guys. Uh, no, no survivors. There we go. Open for traffic. Much more peaceful now that we took care of that guy. Uh, let's go grab this barrel over here. Check for loot. Nah. We pretty much got all the loot that we can.
That will open the door, I believe, right here. If you wanted to go back in there for any reason. We don't really need to. Hey, guys. You're still alive? You best stay down if you want to survive, because... Sorry. I've had my fill of you guys. I will finish the job. Taking those guys down before, and I'll do it again. And that is pretty much the end of this chapter. It's kind of short and sweet, but at the same time, it's easy to die a lot if you're not familiar. Um, I guess we can go on. I'm looking for any loot. Don't want to miss anything. Ah, so this is the, the hedge maze. This is actually one of my favorite parts. This is probably going to be the next episode. This part was in the original, but everything we just did with the giant and all that I don't think that was in the original I could be wrong I don't think it was though Ashley where are you but this part is and I like this part let's go ahead and grab this there actually was another accessory in there um, we already got it basically it is I think I can show it to you it is this a stylish mask for Ashley kind of interesting all right, here we go. Afraid, you know. But you can't run. You gotta keep moving forward. We will beat this. Together. I don't know if I can. You can. Just give me a heads up before you stab me next time, okay? <laughs> Leon, I Thanks. You really messed up my hand back there, you know? You may have surprised me once, Ashley, but never again. I'm always going to be waiting for you to betray. All right, so that didn't take too long. Only 34 minutes there. Probably one of the shorter ones, but we did go through it very efficiently. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. If you did, please go ahead and drop a like. It, it definitely helps me out. And I hope to see you in the next episode where we will begin chapter 9. Very low on ammo, so hopefully we'll be able to craft some more. <laughs> Take it easy, friends.